We don't need to add this. You just need to use your eyes to do what? After seeking the face of God and feeling now you are ready to do what? To get married, to settle. Hey, that is a special order. <laughs> that seems to be very special. Yogurt. Then it is, it is now vanilla or what now? Strawberry. That, that's very serious. Uh, that's very serious. It is not wrong to get someone, Cynthia. To find somebody. When I look at you people, I can, I can uh, career, uh, 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 let me not mention names. When, when you look at people, people are ready, Cynthia. The process is important. That's why I've called you today. I'll take no minutes. In this, this scripture talks about the marriage of the Lamb. Meaning Christ the Messiah. The marriage of the Lamb. There is no any other better marriage than that. There is no any other better example than that. Save you. The marriage of the Lamb. They begin by saying, there was a celebration in heaven. It is like the big multitude of angels. They have heard the lamb is marrying. Then there was a lot of joy. Let us celebrate. Come. Let's celebrate and give him honor and glory. He said, for the Lord God Almighty, our God does what? Reigns. So in that process, God must do what? Must reign. Do not allow Satan to sneak in and begin reigning. Because I'm telling you for sure, you will need God in that marriage. Don't abandon there. Let us rejoice. Because he reigns. Reign. The 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 process matters. The purity of that process matters. The Lord. Let us rejoice. I have told you your intention as you are marrying is to give God glory and honor. Sindio. So the process of glory and honor. And I have now introduced to you the rest. It's so beautiful to be married and both of you are walking to church. It is so beautiful. It is so beautiful to marry a young man who will never beat you. So beautiful. Many marriages are broken because they are beating each other. And they are fighting. I want to tell you the truth. The serious anxiety in the heart of every young girl is not who will marry them. But what type of person will they meet? That's the biggest. Because making a decision that I will marry you is not a joke. Because that person will be in your life forever. And you don't know they come with a lot of nonsense. When getting your choyo, when getting your fitina, a lot of things. So, so settling on one person is the most difficult thing because of what is happening in the society. Our society, as I told you the other day, is a rotten one. Where we have ni watu ambao wana pick everything from social media. Their life is by social totally controlled. By social media. We have a social media generation. They were not built and raised in a way that they can learn from the rest. So you don't know when to choose. Because the person you see in a good suit may be very good only in suit. They can only be good as far as suits are concerned. But beyond that, forget about everything else good. Every time. Why do people want to marry worshippers? Because all people want to talk war worshippers. I've seen that for a very long time. Okay. worshipper. If you ask carefully, but most of what we are correspondent, we are worshipper, but because when I was a sema, sasa try correspondent, sasa adu taki sasa ashering, adu taki jikoni, si na taka tu wapi. Listen. Don't run to worship us. Look at a woman who will help you glorify God and give God honor. Why? You don't have an altar in your house. You have no keyboardists. You don't have speakers. So if you are looking for worshipers, you will be so surprised. Kwa nyumba yako hakuna nini? Hakuna altar. You are looking for someone you can live with. 
not only to live, but someone to help you prepare for the coming of the Messiah. And I've told you these two foundations are important. The process you are doing must bring Christ in the picture. If you have found a girl, somebody tells you you can't meet, you can. You can. The only thing you must do, whatever you do in meeting, you must meet in a place where Christ the Messiah can be invited and he comes. I've told you, in everything you do, Christ is where you, that's where your eyes are. Vijana wangu muko. If you find a young girl whom you are saying, can you please come and invite in and visit me? I want us to discuss about uh, the pale horse. <laughs> and then she comes. Tafadali, cancel that thing there. Cancel it there. That is not a wife material. You ni goi goi jambazi. That is a, you know, it was my jambazi wame jificha kwa church, kwa gaun. Anybody who is willing, who does not, whatever you tell them, they don't put the honor of God first. Those are not good. A man who is willing to invite you and you go and they will not raise alarm, that man is goi goi. Anahalikanga wasana kwa nyumba yake. Run away for your life. Run away. Any girl who, is, who invite a girl and she comes and, and, and cook for you, please forget about that girl. You ni goi goi kabisa jambazi kabisa ni jangili. Okay? What am I saying? You will so powerful, powerful when you find a girl that tell, please come to my house and she stands her ground. He said, please listen. You know it is not going to glorify God. We will not glorify God. They sing, let us rejoice and be glad because the process is pure. It has glorified God. When you see a lady in the church, and you have, someone ask, Sasa ni kiona nifanye nini, ni meona tu mshana. So what do I do? Please, there are two things acceptable. Two ways that are acceptable. Somebody will tell you, kiona mshana, don't talk to her. No, 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 no. If you talk to her, there's no problem. If you don't talk to her, there's still no problem. Use what will give God glory. Is that right? Me, I don't talk to girls on behalf of men. Me, ni liongea na wangu peke angu. Na nikiongea na yetu na nikaongea na hivi, nikapeleka hivi, alafu nikapeleka hivi, nikapeleka hivi, alafu vilili enda hivi, nikurudi hivi, nikapara imiengiana. <laughs> na tumewana mpaka leo. Tumewana. Sasa yu wataka nani ya kuongelesia wako? Kipata msichana, usikuji kwa pasta, pasta, nimeona mutu. Nimeona nani? Mutu, lakini sasa, sasa nikuwa na kuleza. Um, Nifanya aji. Kwa sababu najua, tangu waokoke ya mikoka ndani ya toba. The only word that I do is praise the Lord. Let us go to crusades and do evangelism. I tell you how to talk to a girl on serious matters of now and and a chora chini. Then you saw what Sanwa Toban is strong. They will look straight in the eyes and say, "Excuse me, can you say what you wanted to say?" And now that I'm going to pull a pole, Jamani. Peleka wana wadamu pole pole. When you find a lady, please, you are allowed to talk to her. Okay? Don't test. Please don't allow a man who is going to do that with you. Okay? Get a man. Get a lady. Talk. Muki agree. Only when you agree, report that thing. Do not come to my office with things you are testing. Okay? So that is allowed. To talk to find a girl and sit her down here kwa ile corner. Na mnaambia hey dada, kusema ukweli mimi sina maneno mengi, niko very straight to the point. I at least you can see me have I ever called you before? No. Have I ever met you before? No. Have I ever even texted you? No. Did you see even was up yangu? No. Is there any day I've greeted you and say in a way that you feel like I've embarrassed you? No. So when I called you earlier, I'm very serious. Sit down. Now we sit. Praise the Lord, amen. My name is so and so you know me, right? I'm looking for a partner. <laughs> me I want to marry <laughs> what do you say I'm trying to say you can have a meeting and talk about marriage is a serious issue you don't want to pit for, uh, never approach a lady kupitia simu na text 
It is in the process of salvation. Faith. Kwani hiyo nyumba mtaongea na simu? Sit down, talk to her. Hapana andika message kwake unaambia ni habari mzuri. Uko sawa eh? Hata mimi niko sawa pande hii. Unaendelea anga haje mzuri. Katika jina la Yesu eh, nilikuwa nauliza eh, na wasichana wako very sharp. Remember wasichana are more sharp at your age. Msichana your age is more sharper than you. Their brain capacity is bigger. Okay? So kitambo wanzi hizo stories zaka ashajua what you want. Kitambo sana anakuangaleka macho na ana kili yako yote. So it is better you be straight and strong. Hapana jifanya hapo eti unaanza na certificate zako. Do you know I sat for my exams 2019 and I actually I found a hey, I, I really passed and you to forget about passing. It is not seen. Vijana mna na vile mko na suit kali kali hapo. If you want to marry, hapana pita kuchochoro, mara uende marurui, urudi utokeka yole junction, forget those things. Meet her down and talk to her. Abukuse. Kuya ka hapa. Once you do and you agree, and I've told you these things, Mschana, you have all power with you. Okay? Do not agree to people you don't know. I have so many young men who are joking with girls. They come test you, wana kuongelesha, ana kuleta karibu mpaka anavigia the Lord is helping me. I think the Lord has given me my partner. Then before you know, he has withdrawn. Unasikia ndio hiyo ako sasa kabete alta. Huko pia ameona tunda. Unajua tunda? Tunda ni mnyama fulani ndege fulani. Ameona huko anataka kutega. Huko ameona sana bwana siwe mimi naitwa anga Johnson Johnson. Na nilikuwa nafikiria nataka kufanya hivi alafu wewe unaambia unakubali direct dog unasikia ndio yo sasa ameruka ako wapi loy tok tok main there's a problem be careful before you use your most important answer call yes before you release such a very important answer that is the most important answer you have in your life i'm empowering you the only answer you have in your life is call yes it is so important to use it You cannot use it on two men. You can only release it on one man. Yes. Yes is a very expensive word. Because yes gives him right to your life. Yes gives him access. Yes makes submission. Yes. Don't, don't use it. Don't, don't use it. Don't use it. Don't accept it easily. Only say yes if you have done your own investigation then you are aware because the process what glory hope. you want a man to marry that's good but the first foundation is salvation not the first step he is saying that two men were building their house and he's saying one was building in wisdom and laying it heavily on the rock and the rock is who jesus then that happened. so don't tell me you will preach to him umtoe catholic don't do those things do not do it each one of you yes you are you have your ribs you have you are you are here you ipuguza hivi kuna mmoja missing you have your rib do not be worried and many things wait on god and make great choices when you use that word yes you will not distract it distract it again and say no i never meant it you will be careless and and and, and weak be strong so whoever you say yes to is the person you have done your own thorough investigation and you have agreed and i told you earlier it is easy to investigate this sons of adam very easy okay sasa wewe ukitaka kujua kuhusu sampao kwani ni ngumu kwani sampao sio kwa namba yake sitaki sampao kuja kaa hapa chini so wewe unaenda ngaje habari ya nyumba yako na maisha yako inaendelea je na wewe mbona unakujenga chacha asubuhi i mean it is easy to get you kwani wewe unataka kupata inakuwa ngumu kukupata 
Sinakupata tu. Hata sahihi nikitaka kujua kwenu leo kwenu ni wapi pande gani ya Kenya? You just give me your name na kwenu ni pande gani? I'll follow it. I'll talk to the pastor and the bishop. I will get to know that village, what's going on in that family. I will get everything. That woman who is what you, that lady you want to marry will get all the information all day kamoja day one. So now she can make her uh, choices and her decisions well in formed. The Bible say my people perish because of what? And what is knowledge? The information. You have no information you are agreeing after agreeing is one when now you want to begin looking for information. And you have already agreed. And I've told you the most precious word you have is yes. And you have used That was the only vote you had. That's the only weapon you have against this sons of Adam. That's the only weapon you have. Alapo umetumia kele. Sisaza umebaki hapo. Yasama muu bishop kuja. Kabisa ni misama yes na kisi kujua umutu. Tafadhali ni saidie. Vile ya meanza kuniangalia na macho hima chake siya ukufu kabisa. Tafadhali ni saidie. No, 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 no. Do your own investigation and ensure everything is good. Once you agree, you cannot return back. Don't change your mind. Young man. Before you please don't come disturbing me of his bishop mtu sasa mimi nilimongelesha yeye na siko anemjua vizuri hapana ongelesha stranger investigate first i don't know whether how many of you are under investigation i may not know do you at this year work well okay investigate until you have you have agreed that you have known this is the right person now who is the right person the right person is the person who is giving god Glory and honor. Don't think she will be house. Now she wants the people. Look at how. Look at how. How is trying to God now? Begin interacting with the people and talking. Look at that. That is the better foundation, honor and glory. The process. The thing what? Honor. Investigate until you are sure. Don't be because if you make a mistake to tell you the truth, you will carry that burden alone. And nobody you will not cry to us. You made your own choice. As the pastors, we don't tell you don't marry her. We don't say those things. The person you bring is the person we bless. Actually, even if I know the person you are marrying is a wrong number, I will not tell you. Because it was a responsibility to know that thing. Because I'll, uh, if I tell you this is a wrong number, I will be putting you against the sheep of Christ. Even wrong numbers are the sheep of Christ. Okay? So it is your role to investigate. Many one way you bring it to me, I will tell you to Mekubaliana, eh, letter eh. Ni wewe, unaito nani? Agwe degi. Ni wewe, thank you. Now, sit down, agwe degi. Umekubalia um, unkijana? Eh, unajua unkijana? Na mjua. Umemfanya investigation? Eh, umekubalia na ye kabisa? Wataka kuowe? Eh, thank you. And then, kwa V, C, D. The same day. Si kesho, the same day. Because I believe you have already agreed you know whom you have said yes to. I'm also aware that you have investigated her. You are okay with her character. You want to marry her. And I've told you don't be captivated and controlled by their beauty. Please. Beauty fades away. Beauty ni flower. It fades. The young girl you are seeing today is very beautiful. After marriage and getting 40 children will totally be something else. Okay? Be careful. Beauty does what? Fades. Don't be so much controlled by her beauty until you do not do your homework well. Even if she's beautiful, insist on knowing her talk wapi. Insist on knowing the parents. Insist on trying to know somebody else. Try to get someone who can tell you her bad part. Do not want to know her good part or his good part. His good part is not important. That is godly good. The most important part ni pande yake mbaya. That's the most important part. Find to know her bad character. 
That's what you need to fight for. Once you know her bad character, you can now make your choices with information. Now you say whether you can control her, you can talk to her and forgive her and walk with her and move with her well and teach her or teach him. If you can't, stay, move on. Be careful. I am trying to tell you the process must give God what and what? And he's saying that the book of Ruth chapter number 3 verse 11. Ruth 3 11. And it was while night and any. Huh? Ruth. Ruth. Yeah, not a Ruth. I don't know how many people of you here are born again and you love Jesus. Amen means what now? You're born again and love Jesus. Thank you. I'm also, uh, we, we, we are colleagues on that line. Mm. That must be Kabiru. Where is Ruth? After Judges. Judges is before somewhere. Yeah. After Judges. Amen. I'm reading Ruth chapter 3 verse 11. He's saying, he's saying, and now my daughter, don't be afraid. I will be, um, I will do for you all you ask. All the people of my town knows that you are a woman of a noble character. He's saying it is known where? In the town. It is not a secret. Everybody knows that you are a woman of integrity. Don't be afraid. Meaning he did his own investigation well. He is confirming. Now don't be afraid. I will do it. I will go and approach the elders of the of, 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 of my of my own and address them on the matter of marrying you. That was now Boaz and Ruth. And you know that is where uh, the lineage of the Messiah came from. He stood up and said, my daughter, now don't be afraid. It is known in the entire village, you are a woman of integrity. You are not loose. You are strong. You start with your word. If I go to your pastor, I can get a good testimony about you. Do not worry, my daughter. He said, everybody knows your character. Why without knowing a character? Why? Why? Do not worry, my dear. Everybody knows you in this area. I've dried my well, my part. I've talked even to your enemy. Even the enemy has given me a good report about you. Don't rush. Get to know. And this scripture is telling us something. Everybody in this town, meaning don't ignore his or her village. Don't ignore. Some characters comes back from, follow people, follows people from where? From the family. Be careful. She can be very beautiful. Don't focus on her. Look past her. Look past him. Go back home and check the lineage well careful. Okay, whatever you get, whether the lineage is crooked, that's, that's up to you now to make decision. If you still decide that even if when you are single, you are empty, I'm still marrying. That's right. I'm still marrying. That's right. If you say but I'm still marrying you, that's okay. It is now your decision. You know whom you are doing what. That's right. You knew. Mona yule muna ite mbarambamba. Ande toke mbarambamba mba vi. Ada idega ada pata muti ana nguke chini ana inge kwa mbwa tope ana like iti yu ni wakovu ana iti yu ni gospel. Mwa ni gospel. Be careful, make your choices well, right? He said, everybody knows you in this village. You are a woman of integrity. He said, let us rejoice and be glad and give him glory for the wedding of the Lamb has come and the bride has made herself ready. And I told you, he reigns. And I've told you that in that process, the Messiah must reign. He must reign. Once you have brought that girl to the pastor, maybe, let's say, I want to pray that that pastor be me. Then you bring that person to me, then I expect that from that day, after you have tested that VCT, from that hour, the Lord will do what? Will reign. So you don't allow Satan to captivate and take over and now you are sending nude photos to each other and worse messages at night. Please let the Lord do what? Reign. 
You are building a foundation and you don't have a second chance. Whatever you plant, you will reap it. Be careful. When they are talking to you carelessly and sending you their photos, that they have been doing for many years. You are not the first woman to do that. The person who is willing to receive their nude photos. Oh, 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 oh. That's wrong number. That's wrong number. That's wrong number. That's wrong number. Wrong number. I don't know how many wrong numbers are here. But that's wrong number. I'm sticking on one thing. And the and I heard like great multitude and the roar of rushing waters. And they were saying, hallelujah, let us rejoice glad and give him glory now why because the lamb is mine. the process is pure. Go. Be, careful. be careful the rain in that process is very important come visit finish with visit then the pastor give you direction if you all come out negative and I'm telling you this early with a lot of love by the standards of the government of Kenya, you are allowed to marry an HIV positive person. Because if you don't do, if we stop you, it acquires discrimination, which the government doesn't allow. But by the standard of the Minister of Dependence and Holiness, we are not allowed. Me, Miss Wesi, Unganesha, somebody who is HIV, with somebody who is negative and positive, we can't do. That's the standard. Don't blame me. Me, na fota tu. Sharia. Okay? Yes. Uko kuingine, tukana sharia ingine, ambaye neza unu meza fata, that's alright. That's up to you. Lakini the standard of the Minister of Repentance and Holiness, we are not allowed to join negative and positive. Italipuka. Yeah, negative and positive, ukiweka inafanyanga nini? No, we aren't allowed. But if you are found positive, or not positive, but negative, all of you, all of you are now clean. Ah, that's very powerful. The next stage is to do what? Is to visit the parents. Let me tell you, any man who is not willing to take you home, run away. Run away. Any man who is delaying, I want to call your pastor. No, wait. Wait, I want to talk to your pastor. Hey, wait. We, we just deal. Iki takuja, 22 pole pole. Tangu wa kuongeleshe, imechukua months. Ataki mutuyote ajue. Please. I'm giving you a free advice. You don't need to pay me anything. That is a wrong number. If you see them joyful, they want that thing to move forward. Let me pray, Pastor. Pastor Leo. That person is interested. The one who is evading like this, attack one wasazi, na kuona pastor, attack anything to come in the light. That one is a bad person. Please pack your things and forget about that guy. That's a joker. He's going to waste your time. And the way I see you, my daughters here, I don't want anybody to waste your time here secretly. It muna waste your time uko uko. No. The pastor have already opened it. The next stage is the wazazi. Direct wazazi to be ko wazazi. Wazazi wako pia waende wakubali. Waone wazazi uko. Unasema nyumbani ni wapi? Koru. Nakuru. Wapi nakurubwa. Nakuru ni kubwa. Eh? Gilgil. Gilgil nakuru. Gilgil ni gilgil. Nigil nakuru. Umusana akuje ni wapi? Nakuru. Akuje nakuru. Lakini nakuru huko umusana akikuja but the same foundation. Hope and glow. Usikubali ya mekuingiza kwa simba. Unajua simba? Simba ni nyumba ingine ndogo ya vijana. Henye wanajenganga kama ndi wameamua. Kwenu inaitu aje? Vindia, dengira, dengira, eh. Zit na ita simba. Wewe na ita nini kwenu? Sindraino. Singroino. Eh, singroino. Usi peke butu kwa what? Kwa singroino. Tigira, tigira nini? Ilikuwa nini? Ilikuwa simba. Tigira. Whatever you are doing, where? you are not walking alone with that guy at night the Lord should be glorified because the problem is you did not do anything you only walk together at night but you know what will take place from that hour 
when someone sees you, then now you are no longer moving this way. You are defending yourself over what you did not do. Be careful. Keep it in the light. Keep it where? Once you have come from Kijana, Namschana, and the parents have said yes, you come back to the church, we announce it publicly. When you hear us announcing it publicly, we have gone through all that process. If somebody has talked to you and you are seated here, or you have talked to someone and you are seated here, and you have not reported that thing, please do. Please do. It will be for your own good. Do it. It will help you. Because some of the young men talk with more than three. Wanaongea na zaidi ya tano itu wana, itu wana test, wanta kujua gani qualified. Hi. Sema hi. Hi. Sema hi. Hi. Sema hi. Hi. So how are in a water my aqua line and the chunguza gun in the kubali? Nagalia like asema vijana was squeeze and an appear move as a I want tall and dark. I want bright and see what? Light skinned and see what? I like what? I want which tribe? No. And you know me, I can't marry from this tribe. Forget about those things. All tribes have problems. The only good tribe is the tribe of the line of Judah which we have all shared the blood of Jesus. This is the only church where the, 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 the central people are marrying laws and laws are marrying central. It's so beautiful that way because they have been having historical issues. So when they marry that way, listen, don't deny someone because of their tribe. We are building a church without tribal boundaries. Uliza, uliza wafasia alitua msena wapi. Si uko uyoma. Sema uyoma. Usiseme uyoma. Sema aje. Uyoma. Halitua mama uyoma. Uyoma. Na hei kwa uni bomet. Kwa hiyo nyumba unajua kuna, kuna kuongea bomet. Na uyoma. Ni kiswali na kizungu. It is so beautiful. Sasa wewe unajua badu ukuna shida unataka wakabla yako. Uja okolewa badu. Huko na shida, bado huko na ile tamaduni na fitina ya wazee wa kwenu waliokufa bila kuoa kabla ingine. Kena nyumbani mama, mama mimi ni kwa nataka kuoa sasa ama nataka kuolewa. Umepata mtu wewe? Umepata eh? Ni kabila kabi gani? Eh. Kabila gani? Kabila gani? And even you know, unasikia eh, eh, ndugu na asante na shukuru sana ndugu na kuwa na uleza wewe unakuwa kabila gani ai ai wewe unakuwa kabila gani you don't do that don't do that mimi kwangu kuna lugha zote mama anatoka bumala huko busia huko mdani huko Kwa kisalimiwa anasema urie buwana. Urie na. Nasema aje? Urie na. Na mi natoka hapa hapa tu hapa. Ukeetenda hivu tapata mimi hapa. <laughs> hapa hapa mwisho hapa. <laughs> Tafadhali be careful when you begin to, to use tribe as a scale. When you using tribe as a scale, then you know what happens. The Lord is not what? Is not glorified. Here we are from all tribes. You have found a good man or a good lady, and then the reason why you are dismissing such a potential customer. <laughs> the reason why dismissing them is based on what? Trust. For heavenly sake. Trust. Just Makonge like this, this side is another tribe. It now you you are you drop them saying I would wish I would wish I really would wish lakini now you see now kabila yetu atukubali wewe hata mama yangu atakata kubali then you say I you have reduced me that much to a level of a tribe just a tribe you can't do that we are all born again we are in the same ministry of the Lord of the true prophet of the Lord. We are all born again here. We are prepared to heaven. So you, tr you trust me to, to walk with you in the matters of salvation, but you don't trust me the matters of marriage. You are now saying marriage now, marriage now you need to look more than salvation. 
If it is marriage now, I think tribe is very important. It is a scale that if it's used, you can get to know. Do you know that there are ladies in your tribe who are very stubborn? And very bad. And there are men, uh, your tribe's men, who are very wicked. And they are also very beautiful and good girls in another tribe. Does not look at tribe. It goes on to your tribe. Be careful, beloved people. So I'm building a church where I would want to hear Wanjiru. Sorry, that if that's your name, don't worry because I'm using a, a name of Yakila Mutu. See Wanjiru ni Yakila Mutu. Wanjiru itonga Shiro. Sindio. Shiro. Shiko ni Wanjiku. Sindio. I'm, I'm wrong. Wanjiko ni Shiro. Wanjiru ni. Wanjiko ni Shiko. Wanjiru ni Shiro. So Shiro anaomondi. That's so pot powerful. And once Shiro anaomondi, you know what has happened? They have fought battles with their people and overcome. And sometimes they, there are people who are bad on them for that. They say, Sometimes there is a tribal clash and traditional clash. And that is when, when the traditions clash, then that's very beautiful now. Because now you introduce the, 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 the Bible, the Holy Scriptures. Yes. I once presided over when somebody is coming from 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 from, from uh, eastern side Ukambani and is marrying from central and me as a pastor coming from another side, and I went to preside over. In that rurasio, in that one, ini, si rurasio, rurasio. Forget about those things. Look at this now. When I went there, there was a clash, the clash of 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 of, of traditions and culture. There was a culture clash. Because the other party is claiming we come from Eastern. We have our culture. This party is saying we are of Central. We have our culture. And I told them, listen to me. All your cultures must be dropped. I am coming from another culture. Let us see the fire. In that house, children, they are not Kikuyus. They are not Kambas. They are Kenyans. You have a problem, a problem you cannot overtake a simple matter called your mother tongue. You can't. Your mother tongue, you cannot. Your salvation cannot overtake a mother tongue. I was <laughs> That is the truth. My wife is seated here. Ask her if we speak mother tongue. We don't. We don't. My house is only two languages, English and Swahili. Everybody. My children don't even know my language. They don't. I speak English and Swahili. If they know what I do, I have no time to reduce marriage into tribal thing. I have no time for that. I have no time for that. Honor. For me, if I find, if I were you, and I found a honorable girl who life and worship God in her life and going for mass and I am a very honorable man and I'm coming from Western Kenya. What you now hold to God. Because when hey, only one hold, that one will remain. You see, we cannot divorce because we do what? We honor God. Honor remains. Let us rejoice and be glad. And give him what? Hallelujah. He's telling Ruth, you are known as the best woman in the village. Everybody knows about you. I will approach the elders and tell them about you. I want to marry you because people know you. You are a woman of standing. You are a woman of integrity. You can stand your ground. You have been tested and found worthy. You are not of another tribe. You are not like that. Young men, are you listening to me? <coughs> Sorry. Young girls, you are listening to me. <coughs> I am qualified to advise you. In all some of you are 22 years. So I married before you were born. I'm qualified. Look at your neighbor and tell him where well, <laughs> No, before you were born, some of you are 22. So before you are born, I'm already married. Yeah. 
Some of you are 23. So when you are only one year like this, I was already married. I am qualified to invite an elder. I'm an elder. I took a gallon with the elder and broke a white. See you now. I'm old. I'm old. In all aspects, I'm old. My firstborn is your age. Hata ukimwacha umwacha na miaka kama 5 au 6. Because she is 17 years. 17. I'm qualified to advise you. Be Be married for 22 years. I'm to advise you. But now be the calling You are my daughters and so I am fit to say you are oh. I understand look at what I say understand he's saying I wish we can have this kind of meetings every once in a month but pastor will it or will not allow The, your problem is not me is who yeah he seated where yeah huh how <laughs> cool okay <laughs> the bible 61 verse 10 is saying he's saying immediately in the lord my in my god for he got a righteousness as a Uh, like, and the bride with the jewels I am glad because God has clothed me with what the garment of salvation when a garment when you want to marry what where are you trying to look for another garment, garment which is not traded they say I have found is born again that It's not the man of another son. Say my Say louder. I am glad of salvation. Say it loud. I am glad of salvation. Hallelujah. There are some ladies who are very beautiful like but marrying her is like choosing to live in hell. Yeah. They are very beautiful. If you look at them like this, they look like Mataya Sonko. Mataya Sonko wana kuzi nani si kuzi governor wa Kenya wa Nairobi. You see we are just off in the Bible we just who is the governor now Kananu. They say no she's also not a governor. Okay. So mataya wakimuona na ngara kama hata kama una taa kwa nyumba you can just allow to sit there and then the house is lit but character character ina kama mbaya kama undeto mnajua undeto ambaye jirani tafadhali wokovu ambaye kwa nguvu Do not look at many things. I know you look at you know what is vijana sikiza nasema ah I matter about color. <laughs> we cannot be too dark people. <laughs> we cannot be too darkness in the house. <laughs> we cannot have too darknesses in the house. Nyumba <laughs> itakuwa darkness. That house will be we cannot have it too I matter about color. Some people matter even height. I I don't want two short short people. I want someone a bit tall, someone a bit for short. Look at all those things but uh, 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 am I saying right thing or wrong thing? <laughs> no, they do those things. Si wanakata wanatanga warefu. It me I want a tall man dark. I want tall man and dark. So many of you are light people let's keep don't worry but um, they, they, they are looking for tall and dark and the handsome eh oh attack ugly okay <laughs> they don't want ugly people unless children looks like ancestors tawadali kunya soda kunya ni soda Hey. 
Tuendelee ama tusiendelee. Tuendelee. Pasa pole ni pasa soda. Ule pasa soda. Pasa pole ni kwangu kwenye tukwe hii. Ah usi usi some shape video. Tutaka kuona unachukanga soda. Tukwone kwa ulikuwa unanyanya sukuku soda yake. Si wewe ndio kodo ni pasa soda. Bas. What am I saying? I say I'm glad because God has covered me with what? The garment of salvation. Salvation. So many other things of she which tribe and akaji and atochana na nini. Forget about those nonsense. Salvation matters. Let me tell you. Kuna kitu nanipendeza kutembea hapa na mama tunaingeka kizani. Sasa have children. They are also in church. Watoto wangu unasikia wanasema. Yesu. Uwa hii. Eoa. Anaia wingu. That's so powerful. That's so powerful because they'll see what you do. Children don't take what you say. They take what you do. Children don't learn from what you tell them. Children learn from what you do. So when they see you kneeling down, they do what? They kneel down. What a beautiful thing to marry someone who's born again. Apart from beauty and handsomeness and just okay, you want that one? I have given it to you now. Tafuteni handsome, tafuteni tall and dark. Ukitaka wasichana weupe, isora hata wale weusi pia ni wazuri. Tafuta. Lakini tafadhali msisahau nini? Wokovu. Utalia kwa nyumba yako kama amekochoma na majimoto, I have one ambaye alichoma one of us na maji moto and born again lady born again in quotes akawache ukijana akalala anatoa kazi amechoka ametoa kazi both of them are born again another one is a pastor amelala kitanda like this amepumzika akachemusha maji kwa gas akamwagea kwa uso huku mpaka tumbo yote that young man when i met him that day i wondered who is this because macho yameshikana pandini na mdomo imeleta pandiki kwa sababu alichomwa na moto alichomwa na nani dada katika bwana why rush inaleta much fixing they were fixing wewe unaweza wewe una wewe wewe vile nakuona wewe tu na nini nani ndio mzuri na wewe wewe siwezi fanya hiyo mchezo kwa sababu ukichomwa na moto utanilaumu chomwa na moto kwa yule mwenye wewe mwenyewe ulichagua Salvation. I've told you salvation is more than beauty. Salvation. Bwana Yesu asifiwe. Sema one big amen. amen. The book of Zechariah chapter number 3 is saying this. Zechariah chapter number 3 verse 4. What is it saying? It's saying it is saying Zechariah. Zephaniah, Zephaniah, Zechariah. Zechariah should be this side. Eh? Yes, Zechariah 3. Verse 4. It's saying is saying it is saying the angel said to those who were standing before him take off of his filthy clothes then he said to Joshua see i have taken away your sin and i will put fine garments on you that fine garment is called the garment of salvation what does that it mean you may follow somebody home kwao katika harakati yako ya investigation and upate some bad characters alikuwa na kitambo lakini sasa the filthy clothes have been taken away the filthy clothes have now been taken away we have pasts each one of us took on a pasts our past life so when you are making your judgment be careful of basing a lot of things on the past because the reason why we are here is because we are bad on the past now we have come before the light of god is that all right please when you are making a journey and be careful don't follow the past don't focus on the past because he's telling joshua i mean nani here joshua the high priest and some of the angels say to me remove his fifth clothes and now give him another garment and i've said there is a removal when we've come here we rem- the, through repentance and salvation that old garment was removed and then now we have a new garment called salvation so when you're making a decision be careful don't focus too much on the old garment because that old garment was the our old self which was removed be careful son or else you dismiss salvation of Christ hallelujah revelation chapter number 15 verse 4 Revelation 15 verse 4 he's saying the Bible is saying he's saying 
Revelation 15 verse 4 na vijana tafadhali mufanye kazi tafadhali kabisa mufanye kazi hakuna 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 kuchukua msichana wa mtu bila kufanya kazi tafadhali fanya kazi mufanye kazi usemi unataka kuoa hapa na hata uwezi inunua aina pant tafadhali fanya nini kwani unataka kuoa unataka kuoa nani enda fanya kazi Revelation 15 verse 4 inasema inasema hivi Who will not fear you Lord and bring glory to your name for you alone are holy all nations will come and worship before you for your righteousness acts have been revealed so the righteousness that the bible celebrate in revelation that the process was right everything is okay that righteousness comes from God God himself is known as a god of righteousness. So when you take a lady who is close to God and her heart is in God, when she's not going to church today, she won't go to church because you have married her. Please forget that thing. If she's not worshiping now and washing the church, she's not doing it now. Washing the church. And I can be okay now and afanya. Forget about that person. Yeah. Find them serving. When you find them serving the Lord, Bas, that's the right person. He's saying that righteousness, the righteousness of God is a character of God, meaning that person is godly. The right girls are godly. Right men are godly. So because of that, let me now do to you the, uh, Proverbs 24 verse 3. Kisha pata msichana, leta kwangu. Kisha pata kijana, leta kwangu. Kijana mbana kwambia, oh, ngoja kidogo, taongea na bishop badai, bishop na kwanga mkali, apana, Wacha na yeye mtu ni mkora. Wana nani alona mimi ni mkali? I'm the I'm the, the the humblest man in this church. I've never rebuked anybody. I'm just walking with my hands be back like this. I'm, very, I'm a very good person. <laughs> But house is built through is it is established. Remember, you can marry a person you can never understand each other in the house. Be careful. And I said by wisdom it is built but through wisdom is so powerful but understanding the right person is because when you kienda kwa nyumba kuna kitu naitwa nini understanding kuelewana ndani ya nyumba is key by wisdom a house is built but through the beautiful things are added in that house through understanding and i've told you the worst thing is to marry a person you can't understand each other amuelewani maona wale wanawake wanataka kwenda kwa milele na muka subira na kwambia mimi nitaenda kwetu mimi nitaenda kwetu hiyo ni wiki ya kwanza ameanza na kwenda kwenda wapi after two months mimi nitaenda kwetu wewe unanichezea unafikia sina kwetu After two years, mimi nitaenda kwetu. Ai. 10 years, I will go kwetu. Sasa unashangaa. Sasa uko na miaka kumi. Bado unataka kuenda kwenu really. Hata wewe ukijangalia, uone umezeeka? Unaenda kwenu wapi? Who will receive you there? Actually kwenu unafikanga hivi unauliza umekuja aje? Umekuja in peace or in war? Unaweza unataka hapa siku ngapi? Ukishaolewa kwenu utakika nangi? Unafikaka hivi na habari eh, yako umekuja na sukari yeye weka hapo alafu sasa umekuja aje Bwana yako anaendelea aje jaribu kusema yeye ni mbaya That's when you know alipele, utajua alipeleka ngombe kwenu Amen mbaya kuja 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 amefanya because they know if they allow you sit there it will be a shame in that community Anasema msana wanani ameenda akafanya nini akarudi and the, the shame that eats women more than nothing else is alienda akafanya nini akarudi be careful if you don't want to go back home mbeba mizigo yako kwa pepa bag ya huru bag get the right man tell your neighbor get the right person in celebration in that thing because of the righteous acts in the process the process was right so if you are writing now write right of the process or in the process whatever the english you want to put there righteous acts matendo ya 
katika hiyo process yako huyu anatembea pale anaitwa mzee mzee huu majimbo when you see mnajua tu maneno iko fa iko aje iko sawa mkitaka kuoa mnatuletea tu vitu alafu mzee yako around atafanya kazi eti wewe ukati mwenzako anaoa huku kuja kupika chapati yako unafikia tukuje uh, utatuona utakuja upinge peke yako alafu uende ulale ukuje harusi We usaidiwe nyingine wewe unataka yako usaidiwe hata wakati wa harusi huku 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 contribute anything you did not ngoja si utaolewa tu hapa tutatoa vitabu tutatoa vitabu na kuna chea uliweka kitabu ya vile watu walikuwa wana contribute iko inaitwa black book hata binguni kuna nini kuna vitabu so we are glad and happy to keep books in africa We are going to wait for you just tell us I want to marry now please help me tambia don't worry 